Hello, Angela here. Welcome back to my channel. Thank you so much for tuning in to watch another video. If you're new here, my name is Angela. I lost 200 pounds, fell in love with running, and now I'm trying to live the healthiest life I possibly can. I was gonna vlog my day yesterday, but I completely failed. So I thought that I should open up the video before I fail again. So yeah, this is just gonna be a day in my life. Haven't done one of these in a long time, and yeah, let's do it. It's eight o'clock. We already had our morning dance party because, you know, we have to spread joy and happiness. And it's awfully yellow in here. I can't wait till these burn out so that I can change them, but I'm not, I can't bring myself to just change out those light bulbs right now because those are kind of expensive. Anyway, so I'm making my bagel right now, Dave's Killer Bread, apple butter. Let's get to it. currently searching the internet about Skylar Fist songs. Anyone else a Skylar Fist fan? Like, why is she not making any music right now? It's kind of making me sad. Yeah, that's how my work is. Going. This is what I'm eating for lunch. It's a lean cuisine. I've never had it before. I don't know if it's good, but it's quick and easy. That's what I'm eating. Three hours later. I have a problem. This little space right here on the couch right here, whenever I sit down on the couch, I end up falling asleep. So I need to work out because that's the same thing that happened to me yesterday. And I couldn't, I didn't have enough time to work out. So thankfully the phone kept on ringing a couple of gazillion times and so I'm up now but I'm going to work out and after I work out then I'm going to unbox some stuff that I want to show in this vlog but I gotta work out, gotta work out, gotta work out. Okay, I just finished my workout and I'm kind of bummed because my camera battery went dead, but I did my first Peloton resistance band workout where I didn't break a resistance band. So I got these new resistance bands off of um, Amazon and they have like these little carabiner hooks on them. And the other ones weren't like this. They were like, they had like this, that, go, that went straight into the handle and I was constantly busting them when I was doing these Peloton workouts. But this one survived. I will link it down below if you're interested in some um, tube resistance bands. So far, so good. So I did, what you did end up seeing me do was my, well, I thought I was gonna do like a 20 minute hit workout, but I decided not to. I did a 10 minute hit um, warm up, and then I did the resistance bands, and then I did 10 minutes on the bike, so. 
Um, I like to work out for 45 minutes a day, 45, it, it always ends up going longer than that, but today I just don't have the time to accidentally go longer. So, um, but now I'm opening up this lovely box that I got from Head Sweats here. Yes, I am an ambassador for Head Sweats. I will link everything down here um, that I show you today down below in the comments and there might be a giveaway. I do do a giveaway almost every Christmas-ish time with um, some of my favorite running gear. So maybe this year will be no different. I don't know. I'm on a pandemic budget though. Um, so I got this lovely blue um, Santa Claus visor. It is their super visor. This is my most favorite visor from Head Sweats. It's so awesome. And then, oh. I'm, I, I can't, I can't even contain my excitement here. I've, okay, I live in Texas, I live in Southeast Texas. All right, let me take that off because you can't even see my face. I live in Southeast Texas, it doesn't even get cold here, okay? So I don't know where I'm gonna wear this, but I'm gonna pretend like that it's cold and I'm gonna wear this. And it matches my visor. I got the blue little Santa print and reindeer little reprieve. If you haven't tried this reprieve stuff from Head Sweats, you should. It is completely breathable. It's lightweight. It doesn't like stifle you or is that the right word? Stifle when you're when it's hot and you're out running. Like I think that this stuff is the perfect lightweight but like still warmish stuff. Like I don't know. I don't run in the, in the cold but um, I have a couple of their long sleeves but this stuff is awesome and you should definitely go check it out they have lots of different things people have commented on the tank tops and all that stuff that i wear it is the reprieve from head sweats i'll link it down below and one more thing this is really really cool and i will say this about um the face mask look it says merry christmas on one side merry christmas on one side and then it's the blue santa thing on the other what I do like about the head sweats mask is um, that they don't like suck in when you're talking like all the other masks do. And these are completely breathable, which is really, really nice. And I did notice that a lot of like this past weekend, there were like a lot of different races around Texas. So that really, really makes me excited and also makes me jealous that I missed out on them. But um, to run a race, you do have to have a mask. So. Hopefully a Christmas theme race will be coming my way and I can wear this. If not, I'll just wear it around town. But yeah, I really, really miss racing and I really want to get back to it. So I didn't, I miss having the goals and setting the goals and that sense of accomplishment when you're done. I mean, yeah, running on the streets, you can still feel accomplished, but it's not the same. There's no celebration that goes with it. And sometimes we just need a little party to make ourselves feel better. So that's what I got from Head Sweats and I'll link it down below, but now I gotta go shower because I gotta go pick up my kid because I wasted time and yeah. Boom. Ah! No, you scared me. Oh, that was my nerves. What? That was my nerves, mommy. You scaring me. I'm sorry. Hello? Mom, stop pushing my hair! Mommy, you keep pushing me! I'm sorry. Mommy, we got some new food. Blueberries and oranges. Blueberries and oranges. Mommy. This is the first time I've seen black nutcrackers at the store, so maybe I have to buy these. Look no, how cute they are. That. How could I have that? Just nose and thing. You Mom. want the snow globe? I have the snow globes. I like the, I like the ponies. The unicorn? I have the unicorn. Mom, give me, give me. Please. Oh, it's nighttime. It's nighttime. It is nighttime. Oh, Nope, that's not our car. We are back from Target and I just wanted to do a little haul. This, these are just my refrigerated items. This is not like everything about a Target. I got the plant-based queso style dip from Good Foods. 
it's like all plant-based and it's supposed to taste like cheese so we'll do that and i got some lower sodium oven turkey breasts because i ran out like two weeks ago and i didn't buy any and it's that season it's eggnog season folks so i got the khalifa farms nog almond milk I hope that this is good because it was kind of expensive but you know you have to buy it when it's in I don't know why they start selling it right now because come December they're not reordering this and it's not gonna be in the store so that's why I go ahead and I buy it now so that's a little up I also got these good and gather veggie flavored corn tortilla chips with flax seeds yes something that will definitely send you to the bathroom but I wanted to get this so that I could eat it with my little queso dip. So that's where we are right now. I have to go find the frozen book now. It's that time where it's dinner time and I'm going to make myself a little fresh meal. I know the tot is not going to eat that unless there's mashed potatoes in it. So she's already, no baby. Uh, I've already requested chicken nuggets and french fries. I'll chop her up some strawberries. Let me make her food and then just making it in the air fryer and I'll come back. So for dinner tonight, I am going to have crunchy curried chickpea bowls. Alright, so I am on the last steps of making my Hello Fresh meal. And I think it's just the plant based meals that are just very labor intensive here. And that really might stop me from, from ordering plant based meals. I don't, I'm not a person that likes going to the grocery store or anything, so it's nice that my um, ingredients come to the house and it mixes up everything for me. like that I bought a whole bunch of stuff at Target I actually did not only spent 50 bucks but I got two sets of these sheets I got a twin size set of these little Christmas sheets for tiny top and then I got a king size set for my bed these are flannel sheets I don't really know how this is gonna go over but my plan for Christmas is to just decorate a little bit more sorry that was bugging me just decorate a little bit more um, but basically if you spent $50 on um, home or bath, then you got $20 off with Target Circle. So these sheets, the twin size were 20 bucks, the king size were 30 bucks. So that was 50 bucks, so I got 20 bucks off of that. So I got both of these for basically $15 each. So that was pretty good. And I saw them online and I didn't really think that they were gonna have them in the store, but they did. So I feel like I'm winning. Um, but yeah, I guess that is all for the vlog for today. Not um, a lot of things to do. Um, I did work on my blog post, which is not in here. So go read my blog right now. Go read it. And um, don't forget to give this video a thumbs up. Never underestimate the power of a thumbs up. Hit that subscribe button and I will see you in the next video. Positivity at all costs. Bye.